morning, my beautiful people of the internet, Andrew here, and welcome back to another video. Right now, it is currently preparedness, much? 6.59 a.m., March 25th, 2022, so yay. I need to start saying the dates at the beginning. Judy, shush. I need to start saying the dates in the beginning of my videos just to make things a bit more, I don't know. Something I want to start, saying the dates in the beginning of my videos, so. If I remember the dates, that's going to be one thing, though. <laughs> so, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy the view. Hope everything looks crispy because this is the first video I am shooting on my GoPro Hero 10 since the tragic Hero 9 stolen incident, which really blew. <laughs> but, yeah, right now, put this on Route 51. 2017 New Flyer Excelsior. Or 2017. I think it is. But yeah. We're gonna head down to Paisley, do a quick vlog and go today because I want to actually try this because they say this camera has like a waterproof coating on the lens so I want to see if it works out so rainy day perfect timing and this is a GoPro they're fucking indestructible. <laughs> yeah whatever. As you can see I don't know if you can see the bus display but we have the MID 113 error. If you know what that error is, let me know because your boy doesn't. I see it when the buses start up, but hmm. So, yeah. Let's ride, I guess. Let's ride. Yeah, it's kind of a shitty morning, but whoop. But this is a perfect day to test out the coating on the lens, though, because if the rain does just drip off of it like it's supposed to and everything looks crispy. Yeah, that will work perfectly. Have I missed my GoPro so much? I forgot the screen's turned off after filming for a while and this screen dims before it turns off, so that's a real pain in the ass, so we're gonna have to figure out how to turn that off. I just figured out how to do that on the Hero 9, but yeah, hopefully we can figure it out. Just really annoying, really irritating. Isn't any, isn't everything annoying and irritating in the world though?
section up in editing a bit just to make everything crop. But hopefully, hopefully she looks good. So we only have two batteries, so yeah, we're not gonna be able to do like a three hour vlog by any means, so. I don't think this is going to be a mini vlog because as you guys know, the rule of a mini vlog is one hour or less, everything over an hour. That's just standard vlog affair, but we have standard vlogs are over an hour, mini vlogs are under an hour. So yeah, that's how I determine what's what. So, yes, 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 yes. If you guys know what that mid-air MID-113 or one mid-13, 113 or whatever the hell it's pronounced, let me know because that would be kind of helpful and much appreciated. appreciated indeed. I have a splitting headache right now so I am not happy about that but I have to stay positive I guess. Oh yeah, wearing this. Haven't worn this in a while on video camera so that makes me happy. You guys know your boy's a man of style. <laughs> Your boy is a man of style. I'm stylish, bitches. <laughs> and if it's not completely rainy, I do want to get around to check that KFC and shove and checker today, but if it's rainier than all hell, meh, we'll see what it likes when we. Hell, I can't talk. Judy, shut up. We'll see what it's like when we get to uh, Galt's, but look at the trees. That looks kind of creepy. Crap, that looks... Okay, creepy tree's gone, so... Judy. Shush. testing the GoPro, why would I want to use my phone? That's... Look where we are, guys. That's a nice hunk of bus there. That is a nice hunk of bus. <laughs> but yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever, 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 whatever. Bitch, please, yeah. You know what that means. One eternity later. You know it, guys. Well, again. What a hunk of bus. That is a lovely hunk of bus, but <laughs> yes. I don't call it the eternity beer store because, because it's very fast. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Not very fast at all. I promise 
when I get off this bus I'll be a bit more awake, but I'm just trying to wake myself up. <laughs> so when we get downtown, hopefully we'll be back to my normal cheerful self. Well, it is currently almost 7.30 in the morning. Um, 7.13 actually. A bit please, but yeah. It's way too early. Way too freaking early. Somebody's in the comments gonna be like, Andrew, you're wrong, blah, 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 but, ah, if I'm wrong, I wanna make a fool of myself, myself, not have you guys do it. Beautiful island bus. And so, who cares? We need a bit more love for the Waterloo region and on this platform. That's all I'm saying. Ugh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> We're 130,000 strong then. Let's just say that. Let's just say that, bitches. Let's just say that. Best Buy, it would have been about close to 600 bucks. But since I got it on the GoPro website with the subscription, it cost me like 350. So, there's abandoned Chuck E. Cheese. There's an abandoned Rona that's being used as the vaccination clinic. Damn, I wish I could go in there. But, nah, trust me, when that vaccination clinic closes, we are definitely want to do an urbex video about that Rona. I promise you, I do, I promise you guys. But tell me, how does the footage look though? Like, is it 
up to par. I'm hoping so. My hero 9 never disappointed me. Except at night, that was trash. But other than that, my hero 9 served me well, so hopefully this hero 10 will serve me well. Serve me well as well. Serve me well as well. Bus. <laughs> I'm surprised. There's a lot of drama in the transit enthusiast community. Like, holy crap. These YouTubers are, like, killing each other. Like... God damn it. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie, I love my fair share of drama, like, spill the tea, bitch, but when it comes to, like, oh, I like buses more and all that kind of crap, like, oh, this bus is this, oh my god, it, they're amazing, but they're buses, guys, like, calm the fuck down. That's all I'm saying. They're buses. They're frickin' buses. You guys are crazy, that's all I have to say. I wonder if that restaurant and gas station are gonna survive the death of the smart center. mistake I did when I got laid off during COVID was not doing anything which made me horribly depressed so doing this full-time as my full-time job that I'm not being paid for it's keeping me sane I'm still looking for jobs and every day I get my resumes out there we'll have to do a vlog doing that too eventually maybe 
obviously I can't be filming my interviews, but maybe drive around the buses with a couple resumes, see see if your boy can snag an interview or something, but yeah, we're waiting. Busy guys, hold on. We're almost there though. We're almost there. Go. I spend too much time on buses on, during my vlogs. Huh. I think that is one of my shortcomings right now, but yeah, screw it. On your what is it? Left over there, you can see West Side Luigi's. <laughs> see what I mean? Like we just checked out. I don't know if you can see it though, but we just checked out the other East Side Mario's. The like three days ago. But you can see that looks like complete trash with the... I'm not saying it because I hate them because, you know, they should can't be, but I'm saying it because I have a passion for beautiful architecture and that, my friends, is trash. That, my friends, is trash. the 51s come at Cambridge Center every half hour like I mean on the dot like literally on the dot which is amazing but yeah I should make it to Ainsley and test this back way out come on we can do it we can get there we can get there guys we can get there bus should be departing in a minute, so yay. And hopefully we'll get to where we need to be and hopefully this lens actually is as 
like they say, I don't know if I explained it enough well, I mean, no, that's a lovely hunk of bus. I don't know if I explained it well, there is, I know I said something about a coating, but the rain actually just falls off the lens instead of smudging it, so. If that actually works as advertised, the Novas look amazing compared to the new flyers. I have nothing against the new flyer, but those Nova buses are, they just look so much more futuristic. They always did that. did kind of so we can get any more busier I guess boys and girls I was wrong your boy was absolutely fucking wrong which is always wonderful I know my mask is hiding it, but I look extremely displeased right now. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Whatever. Like I said, since Scarborough, I'm not complaining about bus because this is not busy, guys. Compared to what we were... We were literally cheek to cheek on that bus. longer than the Eternity Beer Store. Well, mm. still be too dark to film and it would look like a choppy mess but yeah obviously, but... Oh 
the apartment's really coming up where the satellite used to be. Do you guys remember the satellite and the rocket? Let me know. It was the good old days of that, my friends, were the good old days. busy but I just starting to feel it kind of like not bad I mean it's I just feel it like holy crap <laughs> swearing less guys I think they have been like, I'm still swearing obviously but I just don't think I'm like overdoing it anymore because the swearing complaints have been down lately and when I edit I just it's not something I'm intentionally doing I think it's just naturally happening happening Like I always say with every one of my videos, it's always unscripted. It's just whatever is in my head at set time is always. Now that is a beautiful number for us. Oh, we get that video. Like I was saying, that is a beautiful Nova bus. And a Pepsi truck. <laughs> gain uh, your own kind of personality like you try to force a personality like I'm still the weirdo on YouTube which is what I'm trying to go for but I think you naturally just gain your 
personality, if you know what I mean. Like, you just become yourself eventually. You just become yourself and... You just slowly, I don't know. You become natural on camera. Like, everybody when they start sounds like a stiff. <laughs> Literally, you sound like you could be reading out of an appliance repair manual, but literally, it's been 10 months since I've started YouTube now, which is weird. This has by far been the longest hobby I've actually stuck to, the most expensive hobby, too. But it's been my favorite, obviously, but I don't care. And look, a damn real estate agent on the back of that bus. It's just staring into my soul. That frickin' smile on his face. Oh. He sucks. <coughs> he sucks. disclaimer at the beginning of the video saying if you don't give a fuck about a bus ride, skip to this point. Or I'll put it in the pinned comment or something. Because to me the pinned comment is a lot better than the what's it. It's a lot better than the description because a lot of people automatically go to the comments. Christ. I was literally going to smack somebody on that bus. It, I don't know, I just get claustrophobic. I, I know it wasn't busy, it's just... Uh. Bitch, it was busy for morning in Cambridge. It's not that rainy here, so that's good. So we don't have to test out the feature. Well, if it gets rainy, we're good. I don't know. Maybe we should go grab a cup of coffee, do something like that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Bitch, that real estate agent is a cunt. <laughs> I don't know him personally, but he just looks like a cunt. Can you just tell in somebody's eyes or just... Have you ever known, like, you're just in the presence of somebody and you automatically fucking hate them. Because that's me every day. <laughs> that is literally me every day. Hopefully it's not too windy, guys. I feel a bit of a breeze. I don't think it's like... I mean, I think we're good. I think we're good. Because, I don't know. I just think we're good. No rhyme or reason why I think that, but... I think everything is just absolutely Gucci. Absolutely Gooch. 
<laughs> ah. Bitch. This headache is killing me, but I'm still trying to be somewhat happy. And when I mean headache, I mean like migraine. Like sometimes I get migraines that just put me on my ass and I'm out of commission for a couple days. Let me know if you ever had one of those before because those are fucking nasty. What is under that tarp? Bitch. It's like a mystery. There's that douchebag real estate agent again. Oh, come on, that truck lost the amazing view of the Ion bus. That's not nice. It's not fucking nice. That truck's a bitch. Truck's a bitch. <sighs> it's not nice today, but it's chilly, but it's in the fucking snow that's all i'm saying i'm sick of the fucking snow i'm a canadian that hates snow okay deal with it if you have a problem with it you can fuck off oh there's my normal self again i was wondering why i wasn't swearing like a motherfucker but nope your boy's back don't worry don't fucking worry bitches everything is back to normal but awesome i still love these these paintings though like oh there's one of the city hall there's that's a nice modern one. This is technically infringing on copyright. Probably. <laughs> Probably fucking flea. Okay, I got five bucks, so hopefully I can get a drink, like a hot chocolate or something. I know I said coffee, but your boy hates coffee with a passion. I do ice caps and ice coffee and all that kind of stuff, but just regular coffee? Oh, bitch, no. Oh, bitch, what's going on here? That, that looks new. See, this is where, remember it was all like boarded up and we came down here that day the power went out and it was like, yeah. It's all new windows up there. Oh, that's starting to look really cool actually. Cool little update to that. It's a cool little update to that, guys. But, yeah. <gasps> yes, I feel the wind. I feel the wind blowing. There's the pet Hilton. And, uh, what's a trip? Okay, we're not going down the tunnel of despair. I was going to say, what's a tripping to go without the tunnel of despair? But, Homeless guy sleeping in Tunnel of Despair, so. Now yeah, it looks like Patches went out of business. Or Patch Clothing Co. No, that's a shame. It's a fucking shame. Not really. Not really. Kind of. Never been there, so. Maybe they moved. No. No signage or anything on the door, so. Okay, if you need your exterior painted, call um, them bitches. Yuri, you heard it here first, guys. If you need your exterior painted, call them bitches. Call them bitches. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. I love doing that. I don't know why. <laughs> oh my God, I feel alive. Woo love it, bitches. I love it. If 
such a nice day. Yeah, maybe we'll take a walk down to your choice in a minute. See what's going up on there. Last time, there was like some weird announcement, I think. It, it being one like 24 hour live monitoring now or something to that extent, but I don't know why I'm walking backwards, but the wind is just less windy. Or I could just do this, I guess. Oh, some morning aerobics. Some morning aerobics. Whew. All them fuckers hanging out in the I hear geese. I hear geese. Your boy hears geese. Yeah. Where are they? Oh, oh, down there, I guess. Noisy motherfuckers. Eight. What time is it? <sighs> Bitch. No. <sighs> what's up on my phone screen. <sighs> Smallville's open. Marvel's open. No, they're, 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 well, they're going to be even later. Well, I guess using the other door means going there. 8 to 3, those are kind of shitty hours for a coffee shop. Yeah. Guess we'll wait like the 10, 8 ish, 9 ish minutes until they open. Then I'll go grab a drink. Then, I don't know. Continue our little adventure doing stuff. That's a great way to put it. Continue our little adventure doing stuff. Is that like, it's all that schmutz. Like, did they make all that shit? Is that like 3D printed or something? I don't know. I also kind of don't care, so. <laughs> I might sound like a dick, but at least I'm honest. I'm an honest asshole. So, yeah, I don't, yeah, it's like some sort of machine shopper.
maybe if it stays like this, I can get those two Urbex videos in for you guys. So, <sighs> I don't know. Hopefully, that'd be fun though. Get for you guys at least. For me, it just means more editing, which I like doing. I always make editing seem like a real pain in the ass, but it's actually a really fun thing to do. Keep my keeps my mind occupied. My big vlogs take literally like several hours because I have to watch through the entire thing, see what I say, insert the clips, because, bitch, honestly, I forget what I say and when I say it. But, yeah. And so I have to watch the whole video again, then put the clips in, then do all that. And it's a real pain in the ass, but... It's a fun, comforting kind of pain in the ass, if that makes any sense at all. I'm not sure if it does. I'm not sure if it does, but if it does, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Yeah, you know the fucking drill at this point. <laughs> Why do we have a fucking plow out at this time? It's a little plow, but we don't need a plow. Bitch, no plows. Shout out to that fire hydrant. But yeah. Yeah. I have like the sexiest reflection in mankind. <laughs> Microblading, that just sounds painful. That just sounds kind of painful, honestly. Painful and unpleasant. Well, that's really part of the world, isn't it? Everything being painful and unpleasant. Yeah. <sighs> tired. Your boy's tired today. Yeah, they open in three minutes. <laughs> oh, look who's here. Hey guys. Marvelous animals, aren't they guys? I know what you're thinking, Andrew, there's just a bunch of fucking uh, pigeons, but oh, look at that guy just walking on the little pipe. He just like, he doesn't give a fuck about anything. Now they're all slowly coming back. <laughs> He's just doing pigeon things, I guess. He's just doing pigeon things. Now he just stopped. Now he's contemplating. Is it because he can't get over that little thing there? Oh, now there's two of them on the pipe. Oh, now there he goes. 
when it's nice I'll go under the bridge again but you can almost hear them there there are hundreds of pigeons under that bridge ooh hands yeah. there's like literally hundreds of pigeons under that bridge oh, look at those guys just sitting there just hanging around my battery's at five percent now so i guess yeah you know the drill please stand by i'll be back with you yeah as long as it's there yeah, why can't i talk i'll be back with you as soon as i can replace a gopro battery okay good now just please stand the fuck by well apparently changing a gopro battery scared all the pigeons away which is not nice. Well, I guess the coffee shop's open now. <laughs> I guess the coffee shop's open now, guys. So let's head over there. And yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Oh, that's a fancy sign. <laughs> <laughs> Just wait for her doing all that stuff and yeah. <laughs> Why do I come out here eating the restaurant? Nah, I don't know. You know what? We'll figure that out in a second, so please stand by. Well guys. Restaurants in there are still closed, but I was more hungry than thirsty, so I got myself a chocolate chip muffin. Oh, look at the chocolate. Oh, no napkin, too. Oh, bitch. All right, how do you eat your muffin, honestly? Do you eat the good? Do you go top first or bottom first? Serious question. Like, a lot of people say they just take the bottom off like this and eat that. Like, it's weird because that's how I eat them. <laughs> it's still fresh, it's delicious. I had to do that. Any chocolate on my lips? Nope. I know there's a huge debate like, how do you eat a muffin? Like, top first or bottom part first? I always go for bottom. I don't know why. This is like a little treat at the end. Crispy. I don't know. Honestly, if you get to this part of the video, let me know. What? How do you eat a muffin? That's what I want. Oh my God, that sounded really dirty. That really sounded really dirty. <laughs> Seriously though, how do you eat a actual muffin? Like the baked goods, not the genitalia variety of muffins. Them dirty bitches. Sorry. You know I have to. I'm kind of worried that I don't want this to ever become a mukbang channel. Did I find those fucking gross? Like, the point of a vlog is just to you follow me around when I do stuff and when I eat, I guess you guys just stay here. I don't know. I still love this thing, it's amazing. Like I said, you're really stylish.
So, maybe we'll head up to the Delta, do those two Urbex videos, and maybe walk around there for a bit. And after that, we just go home. I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all, but. God damn it, I hate this scream. Because it dims before it goes off, like I said, it's really annoying. So like I'm saying though, when I get a new job, I'll make my availability a bit less. Not that, it's not like I don't like money, I love money, but. Got chocolate just stuck to the roof, stuck to the roof of my mouth. Ew. I mean, yum, but it doesn't feel nice. <laughs> but yeah, like, when I start work, I don't wanna be overdoing it again because I wanna make sure my mental health is like, good and my physical health too. Because there's no stopping my condition with my eyes like you can prolong it but stress is a big factor they say it's a, with a lot of illnesses too stress will just like I was literally going to risk losing my vision faster because of Eastside fucking Mario's I don't think that's good Because, yeah, there's no cure for catachronus. It's just... My... Ophthalmologist... Ooh, sorry. My ophthalmologist just said it's steady now. So... Because if you don't know what catachronus is, it's a... Degenerative disease with your cornea. They, they start... They get thin. That's the only way I can describe it. Like, the layers start coming off, I guess. It gets thin, then... Because of it, 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 they start misshaping into like almost a cone shape. And because of that, slowly, no, sometimes it's very sudden, like me, like the first time I got my first, what I call an attack, is just my eyes just went gray and done deal. Didn't, it never came back to the way it was again. So, but hopefully, like I said, Dr. Weinstein says it's, what's it? It's not progressing, what did I say? It's, what the word did I use for it? What word did I fucking use for it? Stabilized. So that means, it could be like another 20 years until, you know, lights out, but, I'm just worried, like, if it if it happens like the first attack, am I just gonna wake up one day and not be able to see anymore? Is that how it's gonna happen? But all said and done though, I will most likely go blind. No sugarcoating it, that's how it ends up. Like, if it stabilizes, I could live the rest of my life like this. Like, if it does, awesome. And like I said, the only quote unquote 
here is a complete cornea transplant, which is even the people at CNIB are like, bitch, do not, no. Don't even talk about it. Because it's supposedly it's a kind of a risky procedure. It's a somewhat risky procedure. Which is not good. But I try to stay positive. Ironic, huh? You you find something you love doing, me making content for YouTube, but you have a disease that will stop you from doing it. <laughs> I know there's a ton of blind photographers. Just awesome stories about visually impaired people doing great things. Oh, look at them. Look at all of them. <laughs> but I try, I try not to dwell on the fat thought though. It's fucking hard not to, like pops in my head at least a couple times a day. Like I said, the saddest thing I told my therapist was I've accepted the fact that I will never be able to see my own children, probably. That even shocked her, like, oh my god, that's sad. <laughs> hey, pigeon! But yeah. Like I said, I try to keep positive all the time. Like, it's my main goal to stay positive, stay happy. Don't let the inevitable failure of my eyes ruin the time I have left with them. <laughs> so, traffic laws, bitch. Yeah, bitch, you're supposed to wait for the car to completely... Uh, the car. The, 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 the pedestrian to completely cross. Yeah. But, yeah. weird. Can I actually see in there now? I wonder what that's going to be. I really wonder what that's going to be now. World sexiest reflection. <laughs> so if you guys wonder why I'm always so trying to be intentionally so upbeat, it's because it's the, it's the coping measure. Like being extremely cheerful to an obsessive amount makes the, just makes me feel happy. And like, I can do this. Cause I know some of you are probably like, Andrew, why the fuck do you overreact in your videos? You're like insane. Like, uh, I don't know, bitch. I don't know. That's all I can really say. I have no answer for you for that one. Root 
51A. Beautiful close up to a new flyer Excelsior. With the douchebag real estate agent. <laughs> When the summer hits though, we're gonna do a lot of fun vlogs down here, I think. When the park's open. Last summer, I still didn't know what I wanted to do with the channel. I was still experimenting. I didn't know I wanted to be a vlog channel, but. Which is. Yeah, at least I know what I kind of want to do with the with the thing now, but uh, I don't know. Ah, I don't know. to now so 30 minutes until the next 51a comes so yeah i guess we can head down to the delta and do those two urbex videos that i kind of promised to do in the last vlog but yeah i guess i'll see you guys at the delta so please stand by well guys welcome to Delta Plaza or the Delta Shopping District or Delta something. Right behind me was the old Taco Bell and old Wendy's, which is now Hearing Life and Cash Money. So, bitch. Yeah, I wanted to do a quick view of that place in my KFC video, so, which was nice. Which was nice indeed. So, yeah. I got those two urbex videos done, which makes me happy. So, you guys got three videos to watch today, so I think you guys are doing pretty good. Maybe a fourth if I feel like doing one later. And yeah. Oh, I'm required to push the cross. I hate when they do this fuckery like that. Like. So yeah, but just look at that place. That totally looks like a fucking Taco Bell. And that looks totally like a Wendy's. <laughs> and that totally looks like an Ion bus because it is an Ion bus. And what else would it look like? Uh, Bombardier T1 train from Toronto? I don't know. <laughs> There's Backhawks, Wilcox and Delta is such a horrible place to cross. You think Pine Bush is bad? This place is so much fucking worse. Because look, now these fuckers get their green advance because yeah, everybody needs fucking green advance. You can't wait for 30 seconds for a pedestrian to cross, you fuckers. But no, calm, collective, peaceful. We gotta be nice because people are gonna complain. Oh, you twat licking son of a bitches. Yeah, you guys could just go on coordination. You don't need to turn up fucking Hespel Road, you fuckers. Bitches. Y'all a bunch of bitches. Y'all a bunch of bitches. I am such a dick. <laughs> am I... Why am I such a dick? 
So let's try to get to. I don't know when the next 51 is going to be here, but if we can cross eventually, we'll be nice. Come on. Any second now. Any second. Come on, bitches. See what I mean? The Delta is such a horrible place to cross. Delta is such a horrible place to cross. Well, the weather's starting to improve a lot, so still windy. Still windy, that kind of shit, but it's not bad. It's not nasty. Could be worse. But. But, but. 19, 18, 17, 16. I don't fucking care right now. I just want to get on the bus. <laughs> Oh, thank Lord Jesus! It, my bus is going to be here in 50! <laughs> my bus is almost here! <laughs> Two minutes, guys! You probably can't see that, but... It says Route 51, A, Fisher Mills, two minutes, so... Hallelujah! <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, I don't want to keep this like a really long vlog though, so I'm going to end it off when we get on the bus and yeah, see how things go later on, but I think we did pretty well this morning. Oh my god, can you see that dog? Can you see that fucking dog? Bitch, can you see that dog? It's the cutest fucking thing ever. Cutest fucking thing ever. So damn cute. That's a long truck. That's a lot of wheels, bitch. That's a lot of wheels. But yeah, you can see the doggy. No, he's going back in the car. Oh, come on, doggy. My bus is probably stuck way down yonder but like i said delta traffic Ugh, small buses i know it's gonna be a very controversial thing that i'm gonna say right now but small buses shouldn't be a thing because it just deems you as the dumb kid trust me i was on a small bus for four years when I went into my special programs at school. But yeah, when you get off the small bus, the little bus, that automatically labels you as stupid, dumb. So. Between you and me, I don't think it's right that they use those buses. I don't think it's right at all. I know that might be a bit controversial, but maybe there's some students that need it, but oh God. I should really shut my mouth, shouldn't I? Because yeah, I'm just digging myself a, a hole right now. Yeah, I know what the fuck I'm doing. And it's not fucking good. <laughs> it's not fucking good at all. So, bus is here. Excelsior, yay. 
And yeah, we're heading home now. Just the same bus we were on last time. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So yeah, let's ride it for a couple minutes and I'll let things off. I'm gonna rewatch my Urbex videos. Just I like watching my videos. I just want to actually make sure everything's fine before, but nothing pisses me off when I get into the when I get into the editor and everything looks like shit. So I kind of like having the mental preparedness. <laughs> yeah, I know I just sound like a raving lunatic right now. A raving lunatic. So. extremely cheap vehicles. Yeah. You guys think they they have to make the transit that the why can't I talk? The transit vehicle is nicer because you pay to get on these like they're not free. School buses every kid gets on them for free. So so they have to make these things obviously more appealing because obvious reasons. But past there like again like so long but back then i didn't know what i was doing with the channel like i didn't know if i want to do a vlog channel an urbex channel uh because a lot of my old videos were a lot of different stuff which is pretty much exactly what we do now but we pretty much have three style of videos urbex urbex vlogs and bedroom videos which are just me sitting down on the bed and talking about something and yeah so story times sometimes could be a vlog, could be a bedroom video, but those are the three things I try to do. Like, I try to keep things a bit more simple, but as you can tell, vlog videos are my main thing. Damn, we had a productive morning, and that makes me 
me happy. That makes me extremely happy. So, I guess... I guess we should just end it off then. So, like always, live life to the absolute fullest, and goodbye, you glorious motherfuckers.